I'm going to try to combine yesterday and today. So hopefully you're still watching this. It's in the middle of the video, but welcome back. I told you, I'm a kid at heart. These are good. The wedges at Parmesan really pop. <laughs> Marcy commented, oh my, that may be why I lost sheep too. <laughs> oh, well, you got a good excuse, lady. <laughs> you two are such a hoot. It's so fun to watch you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's fun to be alive. <laughs> Thank you for commenting. I need to close those blinds here because the gardener comes and helps me. He just mows the grass. And both Jay and I agree just to have some help during the colder winter months because this girl right here don't need to catch cold. Still have to put those up in the attic and then I need to grab more and then we'll do another declutter video soon. Mom is watching the Pioneer Woman. She was watching Emerald. Queen G was like, Emerald was saying to kick it up a notch. I'm gonna pull out some chicken drumsticks so Jay can barbecue these up for us tonight. All right, mom, let's do another. Let's do three, the third sit up. One, two, three. Oh, good. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, and down. <laughs> How are you feeling? Okay. Okay, all right, mom, give me another one. One, two, three. Hi, lady. Hi. <laughs> Yay! Bye. bye. <laughs> you say bye as you go back down. That's funny. Mm. Good job, Mom. So Mom and I are having some leftover of the chicken and rice soup with these cute little club minis. Super mini, but they're so good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> you can't really see. I mean... <laughs> And I take off my glasses. I can't see, so I take off my glasses. So that was hilarious how those two ladies early this morning just cleaned out <laughs> all that I decluttered on that Christmas decoration. Oh, look at, look at Allie. Stretch, girl, stretch. Well, she just got done eating. Hi. Yes. You busy? <laughs> oh, sure. I'm gonna help Anita next door with her Christmas tree. Uh, these are from Anita. We got you some extra Kleenex because we helped her with her Christmas tree, loading it into her in our house. I asked for one box of Kleenex because you're almost out. Mm -hmm. And she's all, no, take two, take two. So I scored two for you. They're cute. Look at that. This one's pretty. Like looks like Tiffany. <laughs> Just kidding. Right. Oh my goodness. I cannot wait to open these so very thankful oh my gosh thank you so much i am out and about i'm trying to go to my p.o box i need to go to cvs i need to go to the grocery store real quick oh well queen g's hopefully taking a nap i doubt it but <laughs> we'll see and then i'm gonna go home and get dinner going i'm hurrying up and trying to get everything all done before the sun goes down the sun is going down super super quick lately all right, I just came back from CVS. I decided to go back. My old favorite, the Fresh Foaming Cleanser from Neutrogena. I tried the Neutrogena Hydro Boost. I like it. And I've also just tried the Olay one. I just finished up with those. These were on sale. Buy one, get one 40% off. I thought, you know what? Why not? I'm telling you, this one is like ee, 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 on your face. So it cleans off like all the makeup it does really good got two things of toothpaste because they're two for 7.98 and i had some coupons i also need some more hairspray so i grabbed trust me and look at this i couldn't pass this up this is the elf on the shelf puzzles isn't that cute it's like four puzzles to do i just thought that would be fun i thought that would be kind of cool I love seeing the elf on the shelves. My friends, they, they'll post pictures on Facebook and some of them are so creative. It's so cute. Let me know in the comments down below if you also like seeing those elf in the shelf pictures from everybody. 
I think they're fun. So I thought that was really fun. Christmassy holiday. It's going to bring me joy. <laughs> I told you, I'm a kid at heart. <laughs> That's going to be fun. There we go. Right, I'm going to make some baked garlic parmesan potato wedges. I'm really enjoying this cookbook. So I'm going to get it ready and have Queen G help me toss the potato wedges. Olive oil, half a cup of parmesan cheese, some salt. And it totally depends on how much salt you want. Next is two teaspoons of Italian dressing. One, two. And then lastly is two teaspoons of paprika. One and two. And then we toss, which I'm gonna give my mom and tossing it and then I'll stick it on the sheet. Hey, you're doing really good. I think all of our potato wedges are coated. Ready to go yeah, in the oven? Yeah, uh-huh. Ready to go in the oven. Do you smell it? Yes. Smells good? Mm-hmm. <laughs> My nose is stuffed still a little bit. Oh, yeah? But I can smell. Well, that's good that you have your sense of smell. That's for sure. And I want to grab one and just eat, eat it. it. Eat it, eat mm -hmm. it. <laughs> well, it's going to go in the oven for about 40 minutes at 400 degrees okay and while that's going our chicken is going to be cooking at the same time are you going to put any salt and pepper on them i can i added salt so salt is on there and then the parmesan cheese is already on there so it's going to be salty enough i can add some pepper would you like me to add a little bit of pepper a dash of pepper no no as is you're good yeah okay well thank you for helping me you're welcome <laughs> And then my hubby putting the barbecue sauce on the chicken. These are good, the wedges. That parmesan really pops. Yum. Yeah? Yeah. Thumbs up. <laughs> even though I just accidentally deleted all my footage from earlier this morning, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> uh, I got a little bit ahead of myself and got a little bit too crazy with the delete button. It happens, but we're gonna go with it. We're gonna go with it. So today is actually December 20th. It is Monday. I took yesterday off, so I'm going to try to combine yesterday and today. So hopefully you're still watching this. It's in the middle of the video, but welcome back. I slept so well last night. I must have got like eight or no, eight and a half hours of sleep. And I pretty much went, like I got up about 1 a.m. to rotate my mom. And then um, I went back upstairs, went back into bed, and boom, I fell asleep just like that this time. So, and then I woke up again around five to reposition her again, and I fell asleep for like another 45 minutes, and then I was up. I was like, I want some coffee and get this day started. And it was so weird because my eyes felt like it had bags underneath it, and I was like, you got like eight and a half hours of sleep, woman. <laughs> Uh, yesterday I went to my P.O. box. Was it yesterday? Yes, it was yesterday. So I have it right here. I'm super excited. Mail time. How cute. I love, this is what I was trying to find. I'm a little bit late in the game, but that is totally cute. This is from MJ from Mesa, Arizona. MJ. See, there's an MJ, there's a Melanie, and then there is also RC. <laughs> I always get those three confused only because the M is messing me up, man. Oh, how pretty. Oh, wait. Oh, look at the kitty cat. Oh. It opens up, you guys. Oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. I cannot wait to show this to my mom, Queen G. And it has a note 
Oh, thank you for the gift card. You shouldn't have done that, but thank you. Okay, so it says, Dear D, happiness to you, J and Queen G. May your holidays be filled with warmth and cheerful Yule tidings. I found your channel during the pandemic when COVID was stealing our loved ones on the Navajo Nation. It brought solace. You all enjoy a cup of coffee on me. Ooh, girl, we will. <laughs> Love, Marcy. Thanks, Marcy, for the card. This one is from Santa Fe, New Mexico. Ooh, the natives are represented today. <laughs> oh, that's a cute card. It says, ho, ho, ho. Enjoy all your videos. Oh, I'm so glad you do. Have a great holiday season. Wish you many joys this Christmas and throughout the new year. Merry Christmas, Rosemary. <gasps> Thank you so much, Rosemary. It's so cool to like receive cards from you because i recognize your comments down below thank you so much for commenting and liking my videos i so appreciate just the nice kind words that you guys leave me down below it what motivates me it's what inspires me to keep making these videos just trust me i have those days too where i'm like you know what i don't know if i still want to keep doing this then i get something like that and i'm like yeah <laughs> Oh, this is from Tacoma, Washington. Well, it says that on, on from the um, postage that was stamped. Gary and Katie. And this is from Allen, Washington. Oh, so old school. I love it. Santa Claus. <laughs> Dear DJ Queen G. And of course, Kitty. May your Christmas be filled with good times and good friends. Gary and I wish you a happy, healthy, and prosperous Christmas and 2022. Love, Katie and Gary. My husband, Gary, and I really enjoy your content and your cheery personality. Right now, I'm watching Vlogmas Day 3. <laughs> That is so awesome. I hope you enjoyed Vlogmas Katie and Gary. Farmington, New Mexico. New Mexico is definitely in the house. Whoop, whoop. Tis the season to be jolly. Why do I want to sing that right now? Give a hug to you and your family. 2D, wishing you everything that makes you happy. Wishing you and your family a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year from my family, the Benali family. Enjoy watching your YouTube channel and good job on your videos. Thank you, the Benali family <laughs> and to the kiddos. D and J from John and Linnea. <gasps> How are you guys doing? You guys are in California. I hope you guys are doing well. I think of you guys often. Oh, I love your card. <gasps> peace. Yes, people, we need more peace in the world. Oh! <laughs> I just snorted. Lenny, you guys always get me. You guys get me. Look, all of this just came. <laughs> I'm loving it. D and family, may peace and love be among your gifts this holiday and a new blessed with health, happiness, and joy. The greatest gifts and friends like you, John and Linnea. Oh, and Fanern, their little kitty. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. What a cute card. <laughs> that was fun. From Lynn. Lynn is from Utah. She makes us all these beautiful card on you are talented oh this one's so cute friendship warms the coldest days denise j and queen g from our home to yours merry christmas heart lynn and jeff thank you lynn i love these this one is from bylas arizona arizona in the house oh how cute look at the kitty cat <laughs> Thank goodness Kitty's not into the tree anymore. <laughs> she just likes to nap underneath it. That is adorable. Perfect New Year. Get it? Perfect per because it's a cat. <laughs> From Gwen and family. D lovely life. Hi there. Just want to let you know that I've been a longtime subscriber to your channel and I love your channel. Keep up the awesome videos. Say hi to Queen G for me. I will, Gwen. Thank you so much for sending us the card. I'm super excited. <laughs> a D lovely life. This one is from Michelle in Ohio. Fun fact. 
My in-laws are from Ohio. Ooh, how pretty. Look at the Santa. Happy holidays. Isn't that pretty? It has a little glitter. D and family, have yourself a merry little Christmas and happy new year. Michelle. <gasps> Thank you, Michelle. Thank you so much for the card. For all of those who sent us a card, be on the lookout for yours in the mail. Okay, that was so much fun. <laughs> it's amazing what a card can do to someone's day, week, whatever. You know what I mean? It's the season of giving, and that is so awesome. But I also wanted to share um, two more cards, and this is from Melanie. She has sent this to me a few weeks back, but I want to make sure I make sure that you know that I received it. So this one is for me. It says, wherever you are, it is your friends who make your world. And look at that, isn't that so cute? And I think this is a book, it is a bookmark. And it says, D, I so love your YouTube channel. Keep up the good work. Thank you for your YouTube friendship. Love, Melanie. And she's from Kentucky. I know that she had told me about where the tornado had hit in Kentucky. And my heart and our thoughts and prayers are with the Kentucky, the state of Kentucky and everybody who have went through a tornado or any loss of that. And Melanie, my heart's with you. To Queen G, and it has, look at that, it has a crown and it has G on there. Isn't that cute? I love watching you and your sweet family, Queen G. You deserve it, love, Melanie. And look, how cute, look at the little sticker. <laughs> I'll make sure I will share that with Queen G. I so appreciate it. Thank you so much. You guys are awesome. Thank you, card. Yeah, I, we sent him a card. It's uh, later during the day. And we're just finishing up with dinner. I made pot rose. But here are all the cards that Queen G got, like from her family and friends. I shared all of the cards from you guys. We read them and we showed it to Queen G and Jay. And uh, they loved it, huh, Mom? Christmas is a little bit brighter. Yeah, it does, huh? I can't have God a Christmas. <laughs> that means uh, Merry Christmas in Navajo. It brings a lot of joy and cheers. Yeah. It makes you feel good. That, that you got some Christmas cards uh -huh. from people and they're so kind and, uh, and we're fortunate yeah, and blessed. Uh, and they did a lot of love and care. That's true. All Here. these beautiful cards. Good feeling. Like nice and warm inside. It makes your soul happy, huh? Yes, uh-huh. Did you like how we did that at the dinner table tonight? Yes, we did. I did. <laughs> okay, getting my mom all ready. I'm going to take my mom over to Marshall's. We're going to do a little bit of some stocking, stuffer, shopping, and whatever else we can find. Again, thank you so much for sending us those such thoughtful cards. It's not too late if you'd like to send us one. Our P.O. box is down below. Until the next one, you guys, remember to take care of yourself. Bye!